Hello procrastinators and welcome to day six of the NerdCube Awards for 2022. Today we will be presenting the Falling Through the Bar Award. This is the award given to the best comedy game of the year. A game that is funny first and foremost and not a game with witty marvellous banter soldered on as an afterthought. With that, the winner is... The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Now, comedy and games don't really go together. I mean, sure, cutscenes and perfectly written voiceovers while you're solving test chambers can be great, but video games are interactive and that style of joke is passive. Interactive jokes, games like Surgeon Simulator, Gang Beast or Octodad, are one-sided the other way. You're given a toolbox and can fuck about with it. It's great fun, but the only time your expectations get subverted is when the physics goes berserk and the little jelly man is hurled into the path of an oncoming train. But the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, good god, it's like a conversation, almost a battle. Video game comedy that actually uses the fact that it's a video game. You can simply just play through it, do what the nice voiceover man says, and be done in five minutes. Or you can push against it for hours, trying to catch it out, and never being successful but always laughing. Take The Hole, for example. At one point, you get introduced to a bottomless pit. You jump into it, because of course you do, and find out that it's bottomless, and you're given the option to teleport back up to the surface. Then, because you're an imp, you drop down it again, cackling as the nice man gets annoyed about how much of an idiot you must be for falling in again. But then you stop falling. It's not bottomless, he's lying. Now the voiceover man is on the back foot trying to explain how it's almost infinite. You teleport out again, and of course jump in again, but now it's shorter. More lies come forth from the man. A few goes later and it's barely a hole with the game describing it as an aggressive divot. You hop in, cackle, but now the teleport doesn't work. You're trapped. You have no jump ability, so you're trapped in a hole that a baby chick could climb out of. And then the hole starts to descend. Well, let's just say that that's when things start to get very, very odd. But that's not just subverted expectations. That's subverted expectations nestled inside other subverted expectations that would only work if you play along with it. It's pure, fantastic, interactive comedy, and that's only one tiny, completely optional, missable part of this wonderful game. You will have to put some effort into poking, prodding, and jabbing at the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe to get anything out of it, but it will be poking, prodding, and jabbing you back at the same time. Just not in the ways that you expect. See you tomorrow.